So here we are bang in the middle of the British summer and the British summer wouldn't be summer without the adult caddis fly. Now that is ca adult caddis fly obviously starts hatching out around July, the end of August in particular and into September. It's a fantastic fly to use to catch your wild fish or your resident fish late in the evening or going into dusk as these pop off and start hatching out and skating the surface of the lakes. There's 200 different types of these caddis flies in the UK, all varying through different colours and patternation, but basically their profile is always the same with an almost tent-like body and these really long antennae which are very easy to identify. A fantastic pattern for representing these flies is the G and H sedge. Now a lot of the flies that represent a caddis fly will also be called a sedge and that's because it's another name for the caddis. This pattern in particular is very good because it has a full deer hair body which maintains buoyancy very, very well, keeping it right afloat on the surface. Um, but it also helps spot the flies. So when you're fishing dry fly in dusk, it's much easier for you to see this dry fly when you're actually looking to catch a fish. So pop this on with your floating lines, like I said, towards the end of the day, as this, these flies start skating the surface, and you shouldn't be far away from success on a dry fly. So here, as always, we have a variance in the patterns. Some with deer hair, full deer hair body, some with some dry deer hair heads as well, all to gain fantastic buoyancy when fished in the hours of dusk.